Welcome to WP Forms, the best WordPress contact form plugin on the market. In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix your site's reCAPTCHA if it isn't working properly on your WordPress site. reCAPTCHA is a powerful and free service offered by Google that helps protect websites from spam. But if it isn't working properly, this can be a pretty frustrating problem. There are several reasons why reCAPTCHA may suddenly stop working on your WordPress site, so let's go over a few of the most common reasons or error messages you might see and how to fix them. With that said, let's jump right in. Number one, you can't enable reCAPTCHA. When creating your form, you might find that you don't see the reCAPTCHA field at all in the form builder or in the spam protection and security tab in the settings page. This is because while you might have reCAPTCHA selected in the settings page of WP Forms, there aren't any keys in the site key or secret key fields. What you'll need to do in this case is generate the keys from your Google admin account, paste them into their respective fields, and save your changes. Once the keys have been added and saved, you should be able to enable reCAPTCHA on your form without any further issues. Number two, invalid site key. Another reason why reCAPTCHA isn't working could be that while there are keys in the site and secret key fields, they may be the wrong keys. In this case, you'll probably receive an error message like this. Invalid site key or invalid domain for site key. These error messages can pop up if you incorrectly copied the keys from Google into your WP form settings, they were accidentally deleted from your Google reCAPTCHA account, or you're using the wrong keys for your site. Additionally, there are three reCAPTCHA types you can choose from. Checkbox reCAPTCHA v2, Invisible reCAPTCHA v2, and reCAPTCHA v3. Each of these three types will require their own unique keys, so if you selected one reCAPTCHA type here, but have keys for another, it will not work. If there are keys in both fields, but reCAPTCHA doesn't seem to be working, it may be worth making sure that these keys are for the correct reCAPTCHA type, as each type requires its own unique set of keys. You can view the keys you generated by going to Google's reCAPTCHA admin console. To fix the invalid site key error, you may need to regenerate the reCAPTCHA keys on Google. Once you've done so, add them to your WP form settings and save your changes. Number three, Google reCAPTCHA verification failed. Another common problem you may run into is failure to verify reCAPTCHA. If this happens, you may get an error message that reads, Google reCAPTCHA verification failed, please try again later. This will usually appear after the reCAPTCHA field after a user tries to submit the form. The first step to fixing this is to check to see if it has to do with incorrect reCAPTCHA keys, for which you'll follow the steps we previously talked about in number two. To recap, the keys may be wrong or may be configured incorrectly in your Google reCAPTCHA account. If this is the case, you can simply generate a new set of reCAPTCHA keys. If you're still running into this problem, however, Check your WordPress site to see if you're running any optimization plugins like WP Rocket or Auto Optimize. You may need to change the settings in plugins like these, such as disabling JavaScript optimization temporarily, saving the changes, then clearing your cache to fix the reCAPTCHA issue. Number four, this field is required error message. Another error message you may run into will read, this field is required and will appear after the reCAPTCHA field. This error is often caused by a conflict with another reCAPTCHA code running on your site. You may have other plugins or site themes installed on your site that are running their own reCAPTCHA code and are causing this conflict with one another, causing this problem. You can check for console errors in the form builder by right-clicking on the screen and selecting the inspect option. In this pop-up, click on the console tab. If reCAPTCHA has been loaded twice, you'll see an error message like this appear and if this is the case, then you'll need to look for the reCAPTCHA option in the other plugins installed on your site or your site's theme options. However, if you can't find the other reCAPTCHA option that's creating the conflict, you can go to WP Forms, Settings, CAPTCHA, and find the setting called No Conflict Mode to enable it. Doing so will forcefully remove other CAPTCHA occurrences that are running on your site to prevent conflicts. Number five, spam is not reduced with reCAPTCHA. Even though your reCAPTCHA may appear to be working, you may notice that it's not reducing the level of spam your site is receiving. The easiest solution for this would be to head over to your Google reCAPTCHA settings and increase the strength of your reCAPTCHA. You can also use reCAPTCHA v3 
or checkbox reCAPTCHA instead of invisible reCAPTCHA, since this is the type of protection that spammers can circumvent the easiest. And once you change your reCAPTCHA method, you can increase the strength of it to add some extra security. And that's all there is to it. You now know five different ways to fix reCAPTCHA if it's not working on your WordPress site. If you have any questions or concerns, please visit wpforms.com and check out our documentation page, where you can find step-by-step -step written guides for all of our features, add-ons, and more. You can also join our WP Forms VIP Circle group on Facebook to learn even more tips and tricks, as well as be part of the growing WP Forms community. If you need any extra technical help, please visit our contact page and reach out to our support team.